Brian here with HelpSellMyRV.com out of Louisville, Kentucky, where all RVs are for sale by owner. I'm going to do a walk around on this beautiful mint condition 2016 Thor Ace 29.4 double slide Class A gas motorhome. Overall, this coach is 100% showroom new condition. Coach was only used once to go down south. It has just under 1,500 miles on it. And the only reason why the owners are selling it is because of health reasons. I'm going to go ahead and get started on the inside and show you the floor plan and then finish up the video by showing you all the features on the outside. This is sitting on the Ford F53 chassis. It does have the six speed transmission and it does have the 362 horsepower Triton V10 6.8 liter gas engine. And this coach does have 8,000 pound towing capability. Give you an idea of the floor plan here before I start. Okay, this is a Thor Ace. Uh, Thor Ace is basically a, a cross between a Class A and a Class C. You do have the features of a Class C up in the front cab area, and uh, for a Class A gas motorhome, 36 foot, uh, you can sleep eight people, which is pretty much unheard of on a usual gas. Uh, motorhome. So go ahead and get started in the front cockpit and put this uh, uh, power bed lift up. Uh, power bed here is uh, I believe a double. They might be calling it a queen. Lots of storage up there. It is rated at 250 pounds for rating and it is a power lift. Go ahead and put that up and it is locking. Go ahead and put that up. If you wanted to lock away some items up there kind of hide them up in there and then pull the key out and lock it you can do that you have that option there you go and you can lock it take the key out and anyway all your hidden valuables if you want to put them up there they're uh, locked away okay you do have lots of storage up in the front cab area nice little uh, service window safety um, I'm sorry safety mirror See if anybody's standing up when you get ready to break. Start over here on the co-pilot seat. Of course, they're swiveling, ultra leather, all the fabrics, excellent condition. Showroom, new condition. And uh, the co-pilot does have the uh, option. Uh, put a desk, a little computer desk here. And it is set up for 110 receptacle and 12 volt for charging smart devices or plugging in uh, your computer. Pretty neat little feature here and it is padded. Beautiful padded dash, huge dash if you wanted to have a pet sit up there. This coach is pet friendly which I'll show you the kibble drawer in the bathroom and it does have the little doggy window or safety window down here. Uh, covers your blind spot. Beautiful dash. It is the wood grain style dash finish. Uh, stereo is uh, uh, going to be uh, pretty much everything you can imagine on a stereo. You can hook up your smart device to it, CD, DVD. Uh, here's all your thermostat controls. You do have uh, 12 volt hookups here for smart devices for charging. And this is an uh, integrated uh, backup camera too. And uh, let's see here. I'm going to show you all the switches. beautiful wood grain dash. Uh, let's go ahead and show you that Ford badge. This is the Ford F53 F, uh, chassis and uh, as I said it does have the uh, 362 horsepower Triton V10 6.8 liter gas engine uh, and it does have the six-speed uh, automatic transmission and it does have 8,000 pound towing capability. Most of your gas motorhomes are usually going to have about uh, 5,000 pound towing capability. Go ahead and start this up. Give you an idea of the cluster gauge here and show you the mileage. Currently has 1,492 miles. And this coach is 100% excellent condition. It pretty much needs nothing. Smart wheel, cruise control, 
Uh, you do have uh, over here off to the side, you do have an uh, emergency start, ties your house battery and your chance battery together uh, in case you, you have a dead battery. These are your lights. I'm going to go ahead and turn those off. Uh, this is your automatic leveling. Push a few buttons, pretty easy. You've got a four point leveling jack on this coach, auto leveling, and anyway, easy to figure out. Power heated remote mirrors. Again, easy to figure out. And you do have an option uh, for putting a table here. It's just a pole uh, with a round table. And uh, I'll try to show that to you. The table's outside in one of the storage bins, but it's a pretty neat uh, conversation table if you wanted to put one here. That is a jackknife uh, sleeper sofa back in the bottom lay down like a futon. That is ultra leather, excellent condition. Boot dinette here breaks down into a bed. Uh, there's a cushion in the closet. When you break this table down, you put the cushion here and it makes into a decent sized double bed. Definitely sleep uh, uh, eight people in this coach easily. Do you have, I think on this model, they're calling this the 40 inch flat screen. And I believe you have a 32 in the bedroom, which I'll show you. And all your shades are night shades all throughout. Show you the window treatments here. You do have uh, recessed uh, puck lights all throughout, uh, and they are all LEDs. This whole coach is all LED lights, inside and out. Show you the window treatments here. Kind of a tans, silvers, bronze colors. Again, night shades. You have cup holders all over this coach. More cup holders here. Cup holders there. Oh, and you do have seat belts. And again, ultra leather uh, in the booth dinette area. Uh, this booth in the kitchen slides out. It's about a 12 foot slide, 12 foot long, and it's about two foot deep. Your kitchen area, you do have, uh, I think they're calling this a maple, glazed maple. You do have full length metal ball bearing drawer guides, not the cheap little plastic guides. Nice solid wood. Uh, maple glazed finish fronts with a brushed nickel or a silver hardware finish. Lots of cabinet space. A nice huge pots and pans drawer. You do have the 22 inch oven, the largest that they offer in the industry. And you do have the three burner gas cooktop. The front one's going to be a high output with the lid for more counter space. You do have the deep uh, bowl sink with Mullen style sprayer faucet. And again, your recessed puck lights. You do have a 110 receptacle here. I'm going to try to show you 110 receptacle down here. Try to show all the 110 receptacles and hookups. All right. Okay, again, lots of cabinet space. Microwave never been used. The three burner gas cooktop has never been used and the microwave has never been used and the shower has never been used. Again, this coach was only used literally once. And this coach is ducted, AC, ducted heat. It does have the quick dump uh, AC feature on this uh, for cooling it off real quick and then once you get cooled off real quick, close off these louvers and all your AC will be ducted throughout the duct work. And you do have a 35,000 BTU ducted furnace in this coach. More than enough for a 30 foot Class A. Okay, in the bathroom here, uh, they do offer the kibble drawer. Again, this is a pet friendly coach. And you do have a foot flush porcelain toilet. Lots of cabinets in the bathroom. Again, recessed puck lights, ducted AC in the bathroom, and ducted heat. And you do have uh, a full stand-up shower with skylight. There you go. And you do have a real nice pocket door here that locks automatically. And close it off, of course, for privacy, and then it locks automatically nice locking mechanism 
Okay, in the hallway here, you've got the six cubic foot, uh, I believe it's six cubic foot, uh, Norcold gas uh, automatic refrigerator. And it's pretty much uh, never been used. More storage. You have a nice pantry, pull out pantry. And you do have a nice pocket door here before I forget. I like to point out all the privacy doors and again it locks okay this is gonna be your second slide out this is the king bed slide and it's about seven seven foot long and it's about two two and a half foot deep show off that headboard there and this is a dimmer ultra plush mattress and the plastic is still on the bed Again, more cabinet space. You do have a, a stereo, which is a smart device ready. You can hook up your Bluetooth. It's all, you can do pretty much everything. Bluetooth ready here in the bedroom on the stereo and Bluetooth up front. Between the co-pilot and pilot seat. Nice little storage area cubbies for each side of the bed. Huge closet. I believe that is a 32 inch flat screen and you do have a charging station here and it is uh, this does have a thousand watt inverter on this coach and I believe the inverter ties into the TVs and the uh, and the charging station here so if you don't have 110 hook up on this uh, the inverter will run off the batteries and charge any devices and play uh, any electronics that you want but uh, definitely pretty cool that USB charging port uh, and then anyway I'll show you that cushion there's that extra cushion for the big dinette huge closet double pocket doors sorry you do have fantastic vent fan in the bedroom and you do again have the recessed puck lights and again it's all ducted all the way through and all your flooring is all the linoleum tile look easier to clean you don't have to worry about carpet getting stained and I, I don't know if I pointed it out fantastic vent fan in the living room too so you have two fantastic vent fans on a 30-foot coach. Okay. Go to the central command area here. Okay, this is where you're going to uh, see how you are on your coach as far as holding tanks. Uh, the first one's going to be your LP tank, which is an 88-gallon LP tank, which is full. Uh, battery, fully charged, freshwater tank. I believe it's a 50-gallon freshwater tank. Uh, and the coach is pretty much, it's winterized, so uh, all the holding tanks are empty. Uh, your black tank, which is your toilet, that's empty. Gray tank, or the shower and uh, sink water, that's all going to be uh, your gray tank. And uh, I believe they're 44 gallon and 44 gallon. And you do have a 6 gallon gas electric direct spark ignition water heater on this coach. Uh, flip the switch on, 15 minutes later you're ready to go. Whether you're boondocking or you're hooked up to shore power. Water pump, easy to figure out. This is your slide extend for the living room. And uh, oh, in your charging station area, there's an extend button there also. And that's how you put the slide out in the bedroom. Uh, of course, ceiling lights, easy to figure out. Uh, this coach, the generator only has three and a half hours on the generator. And uh, I'll show you that generator. I believe it's a 4000 Onan and it's a gas generator. I'm gonna go ahead and turn it off, turn out the lights. Before we go outside okay you have the power entry step uh, switches for your power awning and switches for your lights let's turn those off actually turn them on that's going to be your uh, your patio uh, your awning light here in uh, your awning lights, the LEDs are integrated into the tube, the awning tube, which is what you want. Go ahead and turn those off. Xantrax uh, energy management system tells you how many volts are coming in. 
and uh, anyway, uh, fire extinguisher. Okay, I'm gonna back up here and I'll give you an idea of the side, the color scheme. Uh, the color is going to be that tan color, and the color is all the way through on the fiberglass. So if you scratch it, uh, you won't you won't even notice it. So the color is bled all the way through. This is a high gloss fiberglass finish. Uh, when this thing's really shining, it looks exactly like a gel coat finish. Uh, anyway, you do have the uh, frameless tinted uh, bus style windows. That's your security window, your doggy window for your blind spot for the pilot and co-pilot seat. Uh, you do have the chrome heated side mirrors. Beautiful one piece windshield. Uh, you do have the nice brow for blocking out sun. And again, all your lights are all LED. 19.5 tires. There's your nice Triton V10 badge for the Ford chassis. You do have the 18 foot power awning. And as I showed you, the LED lights are integrated into the tube, which is what you want and not on the outside because it does protect it from weather. Do have, I believe they're calling this a 32 inch flat screen on the outside, you are cable and satellite ready out here. Uh, you do have outside uh, entertainment speakers which are marine style speakers, one over there, one over there. And go ahead and close this. Again, your frameless bus style uh, tinted windows. I believe they're 80% 80, 80 tint. Most of them are probably going to be 80% tint. Um, this coach, for Class A gas motorhome, I don't know if I can get it, but you do have full pass through storage on a 30 foot Class A gas motorhome. Uh, you do have, so you can put, uh, uh, it looks like they're doing fishing rods and then they go all the way through. So nice compartment areas. All the compartment areas are lit. Uh, with the light and you do they are rotocast with a drain plug so you can hose them out wipe them out with water throw a bucket in there or fill them up with ice and put some sodas and beers whatever and have a party I'm going to show you everything on this coach kind of give you an idea of the rotocast compartments they're all a one piece rotocast does have the gas grill it hadn't even been used brand new gas grill and there's a LP gas hookup right there underneath the kitchen uh, feature that I'll show you here in a second I do want to point out you do have four-wheel anti-lock disc brakes all the way around so disc brakes all the way around on a gas motorhome and uh, each each wheel also has uh, Bill Stein shocks so Bill Stein, Bill Stein uh, they're the best uh, uh, suspension shock uh, system that you can get okay and the kitchen area here the outside kitchen you do have this uh, 2.6 cubic foot uh, it's a dorm fridge basically and it is hooked up to the uh, 1000 watt inverter so if you don't have any power it'll stay cold running off your battery nice uh, sink here and here's your little water bottle. Instead of putting a bucket up underneath, uh, they've got a pump to where if you want to use the outside sink, and you do have hot and cold running water out here, uh, you know, all your water, wastewater will go into the gray tank. And, and again, you do have full length metal ball bearing drawer guides on, on this cabinet right here. And a nice light, turn it off. And gas struts on, a, on your uh, exterior compartment doors and again that's your gas hookup for your grill give you an idea of what it looks like from the side here at, at an angle nice ace badge up there nice ladder to get up on your full walk-on roof I don't think I showed you this this is your battery compartment area hydraulic system Okay, on the rear, you do have the rear uh, fuel fill on this coach, so you can pull up to a gas pump on either side and be able to fill up, no problem. This is an 80 gallon fuel cell. Show you up underneath there. And I don't know if we can get it, but it does have the four point auto leveling jacks. There's one of them right there, one of the legs or the pads. And this does have the 8,000 pound hitch receiver 
and as I said, most of uh, your Class A gas are only going to have uh, 5,000 pound. Nice frameless uh, rear, frameless bus style window in the rear. You do have the backup camera, which in it is integrated into your stereo. Does have the slide out awning package. Huge storage for a 30, 30 foot coach. And again, this is 30 feet, six inches overall length. And again, there's pass through storage right there. And their package that they got when they purchased this coach, they haven't even used it. And this is brand new sewer hose, brand new water hose. Uh, they give you all sorts of stuff. Water pressure regulator in there. Chemicals, toilet, uh, paper, chemicals. Another, looks like another water hose. 30 amp cord here. It does have a detachable 30 amp uh, power cord. Which I'll show you where you hook up here in a second. You do have the 4000 Onan gas generator. Close that off. Okay, this is going to be storage up underneath your king bed. And of course, uh, all the compartments have the light. That's your furnace exhaust, 35,000 BTU furnace. Uh, it does, uh, this has the service panel for your uh, refrigerator in case uh, you need to work on it. There is your 30 amp shore power hookup here. And it also gives you a light so you know you have shore power coming into the coach. That's for hooking up your TV. That's for where you hook up your sewer hose that's never been used. You do have a uh, hot and cold uh, running water outside shower on the back end here. Nice light. Uh, you do have a black tank uh, sewer flush hook up there so you don't have to drag a hose inside to rinse out your toilet tank. You can just hook up a water uh, hose here and rinses out your toilet tank, which is pretty nice. Can I give you an idea? Let's see if I can show you that little drain plug. Here's a little drain plug right there. So again, they're all one piece rotocast. Here's your pass through. There's your ladder to get up into your your bunk area above the co-pilot and pilot seat. Nice light. Uh, that's your 88 pound uh, LP tank and it is full. This, this coach is ready to go. All the tires are in excellent condition. Oh, and you do have the, that's the six gallon gas electric direct spark ignition water heater service panel. This sun's going to get me here. Beautiful front cap. There is nothing different between the 2016 and the 2017 as far as the designs on the outside. This uh, 2016 model does have more horsepower than the 2017s. 2017 models have 320 horsepower. 2016s, 362 horsepower. Okay. I think I got everything. If I didn't, I do apologize. If you want to come and see the coach, just call the number on the edge. You deal directly with the owner. If you like this uh, video, I'd appreciate it if you give it a thumbs up on YouTube. And if you want to keep up to date for RVs coming for sale by owner in the Louisville area, you can always follow HelpSellMyRV.com on Facebook, Twitter, Pinterest, and YouTube. Thank you.